Hi there. So we're going to make with no code sectioned table cells and we we'll start off with a single view. Okay. Now let's do it in the iPhone. Now that is the single view but actually I'm going to use um, put a table view in there so let's go to objects um, navigation controller now that gives us a, a navigation controller and a table view which is just what we want now the only thing I need from that is the starter arrow I'll get rid of that for now and we're going to be working in the root view controller which is table view here let's bring that up a bit right now watch carefully let's um, expand it out a bit table view click on that in the small menu and then go to the attributes inspector and we need not dynamic we want the static cells because that's the one with no code we don't need any arrays or things like that now let's um let's delete one of those and look at the size i'm going to make it slightly bigger so i'm going to make it 50 it's just slightly bigger cells and then uh, you can press command d to duplicate it that's three sections three cells rather not sections now let's go into the table view again and just to make it look nice we'll click grouped and you can see it uh, you've got that nice uh, apple background there and three cells now we've got one section let's have uh, let's choose three and let's go to one of the sections and give it a title well I'm going to put fruits in the top one and in the second one I'm going to put um, animals and the third one you see we can't get there but we can we can do a little trick and move that up there and now it's at the top and I'm going to put um, food into that one now I'll, I'll put it back to where it was because um, I want the food at the bottom for no particular reason Right, so now we need to uh, start putting some images and text into these cells and so let's start doing that. Let's go and get our images. I'm going to select the whole lot and I'm going to scrape them into supporting files. There. Now let's uh, put the images in. We've got a nice small app. Let's have an apple at the top. So we'll put that there, then there's going to be a cherry. Mine are 40 by 40 images, I'm going to position them in a minute. And we've got a lemon, that small one, at the bottom. Now let's position them a bit more neatly. If you go into this thing that looks like um, a ruler, then let's say it's um, 10 and one, see if we can get away with that. The cherry might, let's try again. With the cherries sometimes causes problems in my practice. Ten and one, is it all right? Oh, that's, well, it's not too bad. And the lemon, ten and one. Probably needs a bit of fine tuning, but that'll be all right. Now let's find some, some animals. Um, I haven't got time to position these very well. So I'm just going to scrape, otherwise we'll be here all day. We're going to be here all day anyway, I think. And I've got another animal somewhere. Oh, there it is, a butterfly. These are all 40 by 40 PNGs with transparent backgrounds. Now, it don't, that needs the food. I can't get the food in, but we do play that trick again of bringing this food one up to the top. There it is, and then let's put in um, the food ones, which is cheese, tea, is that food? Oh well, things to eat should have been, shouldn't it? And there's something else to eat here. Ah, a cake, a nice cherry cake that.
There we are. Now let's put it back down again to where it belongs. Oh, I hope it goes in the right place. Yes, it's at the bottom. Um, let's just test that out. There we are. See, that's not bad. And there's no code in that at all. So let's just put a bit of text and then something happens when you click on them. Text is uh, easy. We just use um, a label. So let's get that from the objects. It's that box type thing. There's a label. Um, I'm not going to do much positioning since I haven't got that much time, I'm afraid. But you should get it absolutely perfect when you do it. Um, let's go to the Attributes Inspector and click on the label. Well, that's an apple, isn't it? This one is... Um, cherry and this one is lemon here we are we leave the other ones <laughs> now when we click on these we want to go to a nice picture of an apple so we're going to put in some view controllers so let's type in view that one now we're going to have three of them. For this one, we can um, reduce the size of it a bit. It's a bit easy to see everything there. One, whoops, two, and another one. Can we get that in? Just, they're overlapping it a bit. Now just so we can see what we're doing, let's have the apple, let's make them different colors. That color, green and one in the middle make it another color i'm afraid i'm not gonna be very choosy about these colors and then one at the bottom to make it um dark blue really horrible but <laughs> i'm just doing this quickly now we're going to make it when we click on this um chair on this apple it goes to the top one so i'm gonna click select that cell press control get the blue line and it's got a navigation controller so it's going to be a push this cherry one press control in, into that another push and the lemon one press on that click control another push now we need um, a picture of an apple here so we can go to these images and just get rid of that selector and I've got a big apple here although the colors not right is it I'm gonna have to change that background it looks ridiculous that does so oh, that looks even more ridiculous never mind at least we can see it this one's going to be cherry again I think I'm going to change that to yellow and where's my cherry yeah, that's a, a 256 by 256 picture. This actually puts the image view on. It's not just an, an image, it's actually put an image view there as well. You can see that in this menu here. So it's done uh, quite a bit of work for us. And then the one at the bottom is going to be lemon. I've got a big lemon somewhere. There, that one. It's not a very good lemon, but at least it's a lemon. And then we can put labels and text in here as well. Okay, let's uh, run that. Here it comes. There we are. And you go backwards with that there. Cherry. Lemon. Oh, sorry about that noise. I'm in a coffee shop. And, oh my goodness. It's not like vacuuming now. Right, so I'll start shouting, but I can think you can see that's pretty good. There's no code at all here, and there's a lot of things you can do with this, isn't there? So I hope you enjoyed that. See you in the next video. Bye.